Well, welcome back to Hot Rod Guy Garage, and today we got something a little different again. We got another yard care product. You see it kind of buzzing around behind me? So follow me along. So guys, today we have a review of the Anthbot Genie 3000 robotic AI-powered lawnmower. Uh, I've had this thing for about a month. I've been testing it here in the background here at the house, trying to keep the yard well maintained. So let me flip around and show it to you. So for the purpose of this video, I let the yard grow up before I turn this thing on. So what we got here is the robot itself, which is the Anthbot Genie 3000. And this thing, it does a fairly decent job. As you can see, it cuts grass with little no problem. It also has this neat feature that if you walk out in front of it, that it will avoid you and go around. So you don't have to worry about your pets or your flowers or anything because it's not gonna run it over. And it's able to do that because it has both side cameras and two front facing cameras. So it has 360 degree collision avoidance, meaning that it'll stop and go around just about anything that gets in its way. And also with the forward facing cameras, it can kind of judge its distance from your obstacles and stuff around. And the mower itself is pretty easy to set up and get it to the point where it is mowing. Uh, so let me flip around. I'll show you its base charging station. I'll show you its GPS antenna and where I mounted it. And we'll go over a few more features with it. So it's got this nice little garage dock right here that has two cables that connect to it. One of them's here and one of them's here. Uh, that connect with a weatherproof connector to the base, to the charging base right here. So this is a garage for it that keeps it out of the weather. Uh, it's made out of made out of metal. The base is plastic, and the base secures to the ground to make sure nobody steals it. This thing, you cannot remove it. So while your mower is out here mowing, like this, if the battery gets low on it, it will automatically return to this base and charge itself. And that up there is the RTK GPS antenna. So guys, I've got about a half of an acre of a yard, maybe a little over here at the house. Um, it's real big deal for me to have to stop when I'm doing at the shop to make you guys your normal car videos to take time off to mow my yard. So most of the time it stays a jungle. That is where, which is where it's come in handy because it helps keep the yard maintained. So. It also has an app, guys, and this is how you control the mower and set up the zones where you want to mow. You can manually drive this mower around and trace out your zones with the mower itself and drive it like a little remote control car. Um, this also keeps track of the mowing area, the mowing time, and your battery percentage. And it also shows a real-time map of where the mower is at in the yard as far as it mowing. And you can also switch it to a full map and you can see what the mower has already mowed as far as that goes. But it's a pretty neat little unit. I'm not real apt at some of these apps, but the app guys, you can do a lot of stuff with this, including changing the mowing height and stuff. I don't know how to show you why it's mowing. So I might have to show that here a little later. But the adjustable mowing height is a nice feature. So you can adjust the grass height to where you want your yard mowed. Uh, it's not going to do trimming, you know, it's not going to do very, very tall grass. But slightly overgrown, it doesn't have any problem. So I'm going to finish letting this thing do its thing. We'll cut to a little time lapse footage of it actually cutting the yard so you can see how it does and what it acts like. And uh, we can go from there.
lot of cool features that it does have. You can see behind me, it's got this little headlight on. So at dusk, the headlight comes on to help it see where it's mowing. So the good thing about this mower is you can also schedule when you want it to run. So say you want it to run while you're at work, you can set your mower up and it'll run while you're at work. And if you got a hilly yard, it will do up to a 24 degree slope. That's not real bad, guys. It does pretty good. It's got high traction tires on the back of it also. And of other neat features it has, it also has an anti-theft feature of it. So if it's took away from your yard, about 100 meters, it will sound an alarm from the robot itself and it will alert you on your phone via the app. And it has a built-in rain sensor. So say you get out here mowing in your yard and it starts to rain, the mower will automatically return to its charging base. And they have several different models depending on the size of your yard. This Genie 3000 right here has a 10 amp hour battery. It has 4G service built into the mower itself. It does fast charge and it takes about 120 minutes to charge from, you know, a 0% charge. So we talked about the cut and hide a little earlier. It is 30 to 70 millimeters, which is about 1.18 inches to 2.76 inches. So you have that range of adjustment on the cut and hide of your mower itself. And it is IPX6 waterproof, which means you can actually take this thing and wash it and keep it clean and nice looking if you wish. So guys, if you're looking for something to make your life a little bit easier, you say you're too busy to actually mow your yard, this might be for you. So, like I said, it's a pretty neat little unit. It's got quite a few decent features and it has been a real help here around the house. So if this is something that interests you guys, make sure you check out the link down there in the description below because right now they're having a back to school sale and it being close to the end of the mowing season, they really heavily discount these. And if you use my link and discount code below, you'll save a little extra more money. So make sure you check them out. So, if you haven't yet, make sure you check out that link and discount code down in the description below. Like I said, they have several different models and options for these little mowers, and they do do a fairly decent job. So, if you haven't yet, make sure you like this video, share it with your friends. If you're not a subscriber, hit that subscribe button, because it does help the channel grow. If you are a subscriber, I greatly appreciate you guys. I look forward to everybody's comments down below. So, until next video, guys, thank you for watching. I'll see you at the next one.